Hello everyone, welcome. Thank you for joining me. So this short restorative yoga break will not only help relieve low back pain, but it will help us to let go of a lot of stress and excessive tension that we do hold in our entire back, our abdomen and our pelvis, our legs, the whole body. It will help us feel, it will leave us feeling calm and clear in our minds and connected within ourselves. And we'll feel refreshed in our legs, our back, our whole body. Even though it's just one simple pose, it's, it's quite effective. So please hope you will give yourself this time of healing and restoring, restoring in just within 10 minutes. Not even that if you don't want to stay in there too long. All you need is a sturdy chair, a sofa, or a couch. And you can do this anywhere, um, in your home or in your office. If you are doing it this uh, practice in your office you and you don't want to use the ex extra props, that's fine. You don't need to. But it, we do, we will need um, a sandbag if you have a yoga sandbag. If not, a rice bag will do or something similar. Or just a folded blanket will even do if you don't have a rice bag. I do recommend whether you're doing it in your office or not to cover your eyes with an eye pillow, if not a scarf, your scarf or a clean sock. Maybe your socks off your feet, but I think that might stress, stress you out if the socks are smelling. But hopefully you will cover your eyes with something, a towel even will do. So please do give yourself this time to take care of yourself and restore and heal so that we can create more space in our minds, our hearts, and our body. Let's get started with just a little bit of centering. Close your eyes. Take your hands, the index and tip of your index and thumb together, which actually helps to calm our mind and bring our attention inward, calm the nervous system as well. Gyan Mudra, it's called. Relax where you are. Let go of everything for a few minutes now. And just start to notice the state of your mind in this moment. Become aware of your thoughts and become aware of the one that is watching the thoughts. The one that never changes, the one, the awareness underneath your thoughts. And then start to notice how you're feeling emotionally. And physically in your body. Notice where you're holding on to the stress in your body, your back. Just be aware. And then open your eyes and we'll do our little bit of breathing while we're in the pose. So to get into the pose, you will sit to the side of your chair or sofa. Let me put my sandbag near me. So the reason I, I did when I was going through my flare up of the back, I did put the sandbag on my belly and it really helps to, the weight helps to really relax the muscle, muscles and the, the spasming that was happening. So come to sit to the side of the chair and then come onto your forearms and then bring your legs up on the seat of the chair. Here the extra blankets will come in handy maybe to cover yourself up or the other blanket you can put behind you and just roll Make a little roll of the blanket so that it sits in the curve of your neck. Then if you are using the sandbag, I mean the rice bag or, or your folded blanket, just place it on your abdomen. Make sure that your knees 
are at a 90 degree angle. Your shins are parallel to the, to the wall. If you're doing this at home, do cover yourself up to get more comfortable. And the rice bag may feel a little uncomfortable in the beginning, especially if you're not used to having any weight in, on your belly. I hope you are doing this on an empty stomach. I forgot to mention that please do all yoga practices on an empty stomach. And if you're pregnant or menstruating, don't put any weight on your belly. Start to feel the weight on the abdomen. Give it time, give the abdomen time to accept the weight. And then just let go now. Soften into your feet. Your legs are heavy on the seat of the chair. Make sure that you cover up your eyes if you have your eye pillow or scarf. Placing it on the forehead, not directly on the eyes. Start to take a few deep breaths. Feeling the belly rise and the, the rice bag rise if you have the weight on your belly. So just feel the abdomen rise and fall. Keep your attention on your navel. Just allow your belly to rise on the inhale and drop on the exhale. Breathing in calm. Exhaling tension and holding pain. And just begin to soften into your whole body now, your knees, your thighs. And give your back permission to let go. Letting go of the belly, the chest. Shoulders are relaxing, the throat softening to your neck. Feel your arms and your hands letting go. Relax your face, your jaw, your forehead. Completely let go now. Feel the space underneath your back, your body.
the body, if your body wants to release any tension through an audible sigh, please feel free to do that. If your mind starts to wander, and it and it will, it's okay. Just observe it and come back to your breathing. Watching the belly rise with the inhale and fall with the exhale. Really give yourself permission to let go. We get stuck in holding on to tension and we forget that our true nature is free, it's relaxation, it's peace and calm. So relax those shoulders and arms and neck. Let go again. If you do have more time to stay in this pose, please do. I really recommend that you stay longer if you're able to. We're, we've been in it for about eight, seven to eight minutes. But staying 15, 20 minutes even is really great. If not, it's completely okay and slowly start to wiggle your fingers and toes. Take the weight off of your abdomen and notice how that feels. And then bring your knees into the chest. Roll on to one side. Stay in fetal position. Give yourself a loving hug for taking care of you, for starting to create space in your body. And then slowly come up to sitting. Take a moment to notice how you feel in your mind, your heart, your back, your whole body, your legs. Feel the spaciousness, even in this few minutes that we were in the pose. This is who we really are, spacious awareness.
bring your palms together and give them a little rub. Cover your eyes. Inhale. Exhale, release down the front line of your body. Bring them back into the heart. Drop your forehead down. Give yourself, again, another moment of gratitude here for taking the time to learn to, to treat yourself with relaxation and the gift of healing and restoring. I leave you with a quote with, by Buddhist monk Thich Nhat Hanh. He said, stopping, calming, and resting are preconditions to healing. Stopping, calming, and resting are preconditions to healing. May you all be peaceful, strong, and healthy. May all beings be pure and free, safe and protected. And may all beings remember their divine nature with each breath. Namaste. Thank you for joining me. Please subscribe, share, and like, as always, if you enjoyed the practice. Thank you. See you next time.